Oil & Gas Investors exclusive Premium Blend video series presents in-depth conversations with executives in e and finance, transactions, and technology. What is Pioneer's strategy in the Permian today? Very simply, our strategy is to optimally develop our full acreage position. You know, we have over 800,000 gross acres. Uh, it's quite daunting whenever you consider all the multiple benches and everything associated with uh, understanding the subsurface characteristics, understanding how to stimulate the wells, how to space the wells, how to stagger the wells. But ultimately, we're trying to get the most value that we possibly can out of our acreage position. Uh, we're doing so by leveraging our uh, comprehensive understanding of the subsurface, uh, continuing to drill and test new theories and ideas uh, because we want to you know, be able to figure this out quickly. Whenever you, whenever you look at uh, our uh, total portfolio, we, we're approaching about 600 wells online, but we know we have over 20,000 drilling locations. So we're in the very early phases of this, but the faster that you figure out uh, how to uh, state, uh, space and stagger your wells, uh, the better off you're gonna be in the long term. What price of oil will bring rigs back to work in the Permian? I think you, you're starting to see a little bit of activity now in the high 40s. You see people talking about it, a little bit of flurry of activity. But I think uh, $50 to $60 is where you really uh, start to see people going back to work. We've publicly stated numerous times that we think it takes a sustained $60 oil price in order to continue to grow the Permian Basin. Uh, but I still believe that you'll start to see uh, growth or activity start to pick back up at around $50. How has the break-even changed from the glory days to today? One of the things I tell people quite often is, you know, the break-even oil price is being redefined every day. You know, our costs are coming down, our efficiencies are going up, our EURs are going up. So I think the break-even oil price is, is kind of in flux right now. Um, and I tell people quite often that, uh, you know, I'm not exactly sure what the break-even oil price is because it's changing continuously, but my objective is to make it lower. And I do think even in the last few months, uh, it, you've seen a dramatic uh, decrease in what the break-even price is. And what that is is, you know, uh, a moving target. What would it take to start rigs up in the Eagle Ford where you have good acreage? Our Eagle Ford team has done a tremendous job in getting our well cost down. So we've really changed the game. And so we, we see our entry back into the Eagle Ford at sustained 50 to $60 oil price. Uh, we could see ourselves getting active there again and maybe uh, completing some of our uncompleted wells and moving forward. So uh, the fact that they've gotten their well costs down so much and changed their cost structure fundamentally uh, would allow us to get back active again sooner. Uh, we typically say around $60, though, is what we look for to be able to become more active in the Eagle Ford again. To stay up to date on the most recent Heart Energy videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking here.